Hi, Lydia. Hi, Drew. Cheers. How are you today? I'm great. How are you? I'm excellent. It's Monday. It is, which <laughs> is fun day. I don't know. Either way, we're happy that you're here with us. This is Right Now. I'm Drew. This is Lydia. And we have some paper to talk to you about. Yes. And Lydia and I were talking before we started recording here about Inco Rimo, which took place last month. Yep. And that is February. International... Correspondence, correspondence writing month. Correspondence and writing month. Correspondence, correspondence slash correspondence writing. writing month. Yep. Anyway, the writing of the correspondence. The writing of the correspondence. <laughs> and you basically, if you want to participate, you take a month and you say one letter written mm -hmm. to somebody each day of that month, which mm -hmm. is always in February. Which nice and mercifully, you don't have to write it for thirty-one days at That's least. Right. That's so right. So that happened. It's yep. over, but that got stationary and writing sets on a lot of folks' mind. Yep. And there was a big initiative on our Facebook group, Goulet Nation. Check it out. There was like 150 names on the list, and everybody's just decided that they're going to do it all year round now. So given that, I thought it would be great if we focused on stationery. So if people need ideas. Absolutely. And I don't think stationery <laughs> is uh, it's not a product that we often give a lot of love to. And it's important. You know, pens are easy to talk mm -hmm. about because they always have new, interesting, fun features. And paper, sadly, doesn't have a lot of that. But if you really get into it, they do have some unique and fun benefits to talk Absolutely. about. Absolutely. So um, I will say, have you you have participated in IncoRimo mm -hmm. before? I signed up halfway through the month. Nice. I, How'd that go? It was great. Honestly, I'm really enjoying it. I can only write on the weekends, you know, because life is just too busy. But, uh, like, I try to knock out, you know, four to six letters on the weekend mm. and respond to the people that have sent letters to me. Nice. I met so, some really cool people through Inco right now. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. And most of the people I'm talking to know me from Goulet Nation already, so we're just carrying on conversations that we've had. Absolutely. So what did you like to write with? Uh, I've been using just a random assortment of cards I had in my house. Okay. Just so we'll, we'll, we'll talk through what we have here, and then you can decide, hey, what would have been nice yeah. last well, month? Yeah, well, this is what would have been nice. And so what is this? This, this is the uh, Triumph uh, Envelopes. So we have the smaller version here. This Triumph. Is now, this is nice paper. A4. Yeah. So these are letters mm. that um, I exchanged with my boyfriend Juan when he was in the Army. Um, these are the letters he sent me. And honestly, this is my favorite stationery set. If I had had this at home, I would have used it. Triumph is affordably priced for what it is, which is insanely high-quality paper. And we're talking uh, 90 uh, grams on this mm -hmm. one, I believe. Um, and it is just so smooth, butter smooth. Like you're not going to find paper more smooth than this. Absolutely. And it's priced really nicely. This is the blank stuff, and it's nice because it does come with a uh, one sheet mm -hmm. of line, so you can put that under the sheet you're writing with, right on a blank page, and whoever you're sending it to is going to think that you just have remarkably symmetrical <laughs> writing abilities. So I like that because mine is all diagonal up and down. <laughs> yep. But it's a really nice pad. They come in, obviously, lined in blank mm -hmm. with some solid corresponding envelopes, too. And they come in um, the, uh, the way they come in two sizes, the small and the larger ones, all of which are self-adhesive. Yeah, that's right. So Sticky stuff. If you're writing a letter a day, you might not want to be also licking a letter a day. <laughs> so self-adhesive is the way to go. It's a great I, gift, too. These two yeah. things, they're relatively inexpensive together. So it's great to just package them together and give them to somebody. Absolutely. And moving away from this, though, with Rhodia, with Claire Fontaine, um, you get really, really smooth paper. Mm -hmm. And then you've got your other types of brands, uh, G. Lalo being one of them, and corresponding envelopes here. Um, they come in, uh, well, I think we just at this point sell this color. Uh, they used to come in a couple different colors, but mm -hmm. anyway. This paper is very, very different. It is super high quality, but it's going to be textured. And I think a lot of people are looking for, when they look for correspondence sets, they're looking for something a little bit mm -hmm. more uh, textured with a little bit more pizzazz flair, mm -hmm. something that might not be looking like everyday paper. Mm -hmm. Also self-adhesive envelopes. Yes. So, no licky. <laughs> um, this thing has been on the shelf since uh, we were in the garage, by the way. Oh, really? Yeah, we've had these things for a long time. There aren't too is many products. Is that our first one? Our first um, paper brand, or one of them? It was definitely one of them. Um, but this one's interesting because the paper is textured. And I don't know if you can see it here, Andy, but you're going to get 
some fine ridges mm -hmm. while you're writing. And like Lydia mentioned, the Clairefontaine Triomphe is super smooth. You want to take it a little bit closer? So when you're talking 90 gram paper on the Triomphe, you are talking butter smooth, which mm -hmm. provides an exceptional writing experience. That's a hard no. <laughs> <laughs> well, here, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. If you've got a nib that is tuned really to wet. perfection, or super, super, super smooth, maybe even over polished a little bit, because that sometimes happens, you're gonna have a better writing performance mm -hmm. on this. With paper with a little bit more texture, rather than that super, super slick stuff, you could have a pen that skips on the slick stuff, mm -hmm. but then writes perfectly on this. I think this is even better for lefties like myself, because the, the Triumph is so smooth that I end up smudging things. Mm. If, I, if I'm not careful about being an underwriter, I'll smudge everything. Right, and that's important to know when you're writing a whole, when you're filling up a whole page. Like, I don't r often write letters. I take a lot of notes. I mm -hmm. jot a lot of things down. So my use with a fountain pen is pretty quick and limited. Yep. So I'm not mentally preparing for the fact that I'm going to be covering this piece of paper in writing. Mm -hmm. So thinking about dry time is also super important. Yeah, and if you try to, if you're one of those people that tries to use both sides of the paper, you want it to dry. So you need to be careful when flipping over the triumph so that you don't smudge everything you just wrote. Mm -hmm. Ghosting is not going to be a big deal with these either. Mm -hmm. What about nib sizes? Do you have a problem using extra fines on this more textured paper? I tend to stick to mediums in most of my pens anyways. So they're all pretty wet and just yeah, I, I definitely do see a little bit of uh, when I use an extra fine, I can feel the texture a little bit mm -hmm. more, obviously. So if that's a concern of yours, you do you might want to stick with something super smooth like mm -hmm. the Triumph, but they're both great. Uh, we also sell a brand called Original Crown Mill, and this is different than the, uh, the unoriginal Crown Mill. Yeah. We don't even talk about that. <laughs> um, and they come in uh, some really neat sets pre-packaged now if you're looking for a gift set mm. this might be your best option mm -hmm. they are a little bit more on the pricey side but as far as presentation goes and wow factor you're not going to find better than this like lydia just showed these are the uh, uh deckled edge cards mm -hmm. and i'm not going to crack these open but uh, you can see it on our website they are little stationary cards with kind of uh deckled edges they're, yeah. they're <laughs> they, they look kind of like not rough but like Actually, you know, here you can see them right Feathered. here. Can you see the edge of this, Andy? How they're not smooth, not torn yeah. or anything, just yeah. kind of chunky looking. They're mm -hmm. really, really neat. And again, high presentation factor. If you're looking to raise somebody's eyebrows when they open your letter, mm -hmm. this is a great way to do it. And these are also interesting textured, but not in the same yeah. way that the Gilalo is. Yeah, original Crown Mill. I use a fine on those. I did it the other day, and it was just like it was too catching. Catching. Yeah. 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 I used it with my stub uh, last week, and it was awesome. But that's for short notes, so you wouldn't use that for a long letter. Just like a, hey, how are you? You know. What I like about it is that if you did just want to say thank you to somebody. Mm -hmm. And then if you're if you've got a big piece of paper, you kind of have to write right. stuff, and you're kind of forced to say, okay, well, what am I going to talk about? Am I going to ask about their family? They're not going <laughs> to write me back, probably. So, so having a smaller card makes it seem more intentional. Mm -hmm. Like I'm just writing to say thank you. Um, Original Crown Mill also has two um, other types of paper. You've got your laid paper and your pure cotton with matching <laughs> envelopes. <laughs> None of these are self-adhesive, though, so they are going to need Get you to ready. adhere them. <laughs> and these also have different textures. Uh, like the Triumph, they do come with a line guide, so you can look extra, have a togetherness. And the texture is a little bit different, so you're going to see that the... What, which one do you have? Do you have the laid? I have the laid. Laid paper. Laid paper is going to be more textured. Uh, slightly different color, too. Mm -hmm. So this one's going to be a little bit bumpier. And this one's gonna be a little bit smoother. And Original Crown Mill also has some interesting uh, watermarks. So if you hold these up to the light, this one, I've got the Pure Cotton oh, yeah, logo yeah. here. I don't know. Is there a way that you you want to try to see this? No. No. I'll it okay. Out. <laughs> but again, it's another uh, bit of flair that someone receiving a letter who's maybe not used to receiving letters on the regular is going to be pretty impressed by this. And if you're trying to look to get somebody into the writing habit, mm. these are great ways to uh, remind them that, hey, this can be exciting too. And paper can be exciting. Maybe not as exciting about pens 
as pens, but they've still got their fun little features. Yeah. And um, as far as continuing to write, if you wanted to, uh, let's see, do they, would they go on Ghoulay Nation to get mm -hmm. a list? Or Yeah, um, I don't know what the ongoing plan is, but if you go on Ghoulay Nation and say that you're interested in writing, I guarantee somebody's going to respond and say, yeah, I'll be your pen pal. That's a great thing about the community. It's, it's like you're so never going awesome. to, it's not going to be hard to find somebody mm -hmm. that, yes, I would like to write letters to you. Yeah. Because this is my passion. I think weekly there's, you know, at least two or three posts where everybody's like, I want to write letters to people. Who wants to be my pen pal? There's so yeah, just go on Facebook.com, mm -hmm. search the groups Goulet for Goulet Nation. Nation. Yep. Join up and talk to Lydia. Yay. So yeah, I think that's about covers it. Yeah. Anything else you want to add? Nope. Just oh. right on, everybody. Please do. <laughs> Thank you so much. Have a great week, and we'll see you soon.